It's go, not me. I my my I say, wow, I will do something. If the race is not clear, and I'm not sure that I will be in the good defense in in court, <coughs> better I find something. It's no work. That means no risk. Or the risk is not high. That's the first step. Okay? Now the second step is I need to see is the gravity. The gravity is if it's high, if it's low. High, I can use half technique. And low, I can use short technique. What means half technique? Half technique for me is mean my attack probably will create permanent damage or you can kill the upper. So that means I hit vital spot from here to here. If you hit soft, you kill people. Here, the bone very thin. I hit with that, I break right away hit. And he will be in coma. For me, it's happening. The soft technique, Grandmaster Van Bing, he's the expert on that, on the pressure point different. A soft technique for me mean I apply the technique when I release is no damage. Some articulation and something just control the afterness. So that control. This you eliminate also. Okay. You understand? Yes, Is correct? So that now I introduce here. That means already I have some decision already, what, I, what kind of technique I use. The next. Sir, before you are moving forward, one question please. Sure. Uh, could you a little bit elaborate the uh, concept of gravity? Okay. What do you mean about that? Okay. Uh, gravity, gravity for me uh, is is serious. For example, he Run. I cannot do anything, and really as long as it hit my face. For me, is he tried to create the permanent damage to me. So it's serious. So that means serious. So I do this. Gravity is low. He not in good condition. He push or he do something but not strong. So for me, I think I able it. I can handle that without. I eliminate him. That means I think I can control him. And here I say, well, no chance. And probably the, 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 the second one, he's his partner, so better I, I eliminate him right away. So, okay. thank you, sir. You're welcome. Okay, now, third part. What technique, okay? Already, what kind of technique now, what technique is? I introduced the concept. Of Direct and indirect technique. This is important. The principle is try to do the most simple technique. The big problem of people who fail in self defense because they see too much Jackie Chan movie. Claude Van Damme, bye, 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 like that. This is nice, but you know that takes them three months to practice only this, <laughs> and you don't have this. You have one second, to <coughs> and no camera with you. You need to survive. That's it. So important for me, as much as you can, you use direct technique. What does mean? Direct technique, for example. So. Okay, if we grab me, he grab me here, or we grab me here. Indirect technique is I need to control something like that, I go. But for me, I prefer boom like that, and that's finished. And that's for now, right? So. <laughs> you understand? The problem of a lot of self-defense book, the authors 
show a lot of releasing. It's good when you have the control, but sometimes you don't have time. The two or three seconds is the most important. I am very practical guy. I get tired the way the guy does it. And that's, he found out, <laughs> why are you worried for? You understand? Here, boom, like that, it's finished, that's finished. Boom, boom, like that. If you are sure, you can play with him. But normally, I don't play with aggression case. You understand? So, direct technique means your first reaction is directly to vital spot. That's it. No spectacular, no movie, nothing. Boom, he found out, that's it. Indirect technique, I use because he got me here in my neck. The neck is too vulnerable part. If I try to hit him, probably I lost already my consent, my breathing. So I need to release that to protect myself. Or he hit me first, so he hit me first. I cannot cover that because too late. So I need to move and I go. Blocking, dodging, moving, that's my first action and I go second one, that's why I go indirect. You understand? Yes, sir. My main different point, the main different point of my concept is I do not pay much attention what technique you do. Why? Because I consider the choice of self-defense technique like the chair of your foot you eat. You can eat Finnish, Norwegian, Chinese, Vietnamese, no matter how you feel comfortable. What go? Spontaneity, that's good. The thing is, you control or you eliminate your That's it. You only work for this main object. You understand? So, this is up to you, how you see. So that means, facing one situation, what I do, very fast, evaluate the thing. Later on, I will show you some uh, the meditation. Some meditation is that also help you also have the good uh, capacity to increase the risk identification. Okay, but this is up to you. This event depends on you. And I tell you some is the Lego self defense that important. Okay. Is legal or not? So I already give you three conditions. Okay. Okay. So is you go yes? Is serious or not? Very serious. You go with hard technique. So you eliminate your opponent. Is you think you can control? You go shop technique. Grandmaster Van Bing will show you some. And now direct or indirect technique. I prefer direct technique, but sometimes you you it's not recommended because. The attack already initiated by the open. Next. <coughs> Next. Now, <coughs> we always See the objective. Is control or a right? That's that the objective. Now, how you can do? First, for me. You need to surprise your opponent. Is stop it. Don't think because you have strong technique that will work. Okay? Partly sometimes you are facing dangerous aggressors. So surprise your opponent mean don't let your opponent know that you have the intention to counter attack or to defend. For example, he came, he grabbed me, 
flat and good the knife. Do you think I will right away do the technique? No, never. I need first to, to use my brain and say, look, if he already want to attack me with the knife, he already done. <laughs> Probably I cannot. It's that well, what he can do. But now he grab and he put like that, he threatened me. He wants something. He, he is too dangerous in this position. So what I do is, I already have my analyzers set. I think, oh, oh, I have a lot of money here. Oh, I don't, I don't want to do that. I think I can do. So that means I already have the idea is go, not no go. That's what we do. But I do not try the way that I right away try to play the game with him. I scare. I mentioned like I scare. So I tell him, why do that? And, uh, and he said, I want your money. No, no, no. I, you try. I don't have something. He will insist. I need to have this kind of conversation because I make him feel that I am like normal guy. Reacting like that. I want to protect, but I scared. So I said, okay. okay. That I, but when I could do that, he want to get my wallet, take the money. You cannot say like that. So he took that, and that's the way I go. That's the time. You understand? That make big difference. So that's why strategy. You need your strategy. You find also tomorrow, this afternoon, when I teach you about first firing, I explain to you the strategy. Good fighters, not only good technician. Need to have new now how to use the strategy. So the strategy is surprise the opponent. The second is. Now the technique. The technique, first, you need to have a good timing. Good time, that means good. The second, you need to have a good precision. Don't miss that. Your technique should have the power, and you, you need to have the proper technique. When I talk about proper technique, that means good distance according to the vital spot. Power. If you read the encyclopedia, the general also has the ring illustration about that. So, this is important. But sometimes, you need some. We call that continuous attack. That means aggressivity. Totally, for some people, I have some experience with some women who defend. She surprised the opponent. It's a good timing, good precision, but because she didn't have enough power. So the guy lit it down and she stopped. And the guy stand up and that's a big problem. You understand? So, as I told you, if your violence or your aggressivity is really for to control the fight and because the other is very strong, the law allow you. Only when the opponent is completely destroyed and you continue, is that not? You make different with that, right? That's very important to know. So this for me, you need to have in mind. You see, I didn't mention any technique. We will show you a lot of technique. But for me, the technique kind of example. You can develop as much as you can, there's no problem. Only what I propose to you is don't use or don't practice too much technique because the problem of memory. Practice spontaneity. You attack me sometimes, you see, I cow attack, even I don't know what the technique. Already go gradually. So that is the best. Okay? If there's any question, you understand, right? That, 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 is, the, that is the practical approach. 
So, first contact, analyze the situation. Yes, the risk there. I cannot avoid it. If you can avoid it, go ahead. If you hear someone waiting you in the corner of the street, don't go there, go the other side. That's it. Don't think, oh, because I am Taekwondo, why? No, no, no. You don't need that. Sometimes I'm traveling and some people pushing me. I go away. I don't need to say, well, I'm eight degree now, I show him. No, no need. You should be sure on yourself. You don't need to show to someone because you can hit someone. That is completely the wrong function. I am peaceful with myself. I don't need to compete with nobody. I am fine. That's important. But now, if I see someone attack the others and I think it's problem of justice, I have to enter because this is my duty. Because I have the capacity to do that. I have to go. If you scare me, I blame you because you didn't do according to the philosophy of the quantum. You see, deep seven. So, now, when is the case? You have to, I control or really I eliminate my tunnel. Strategy, fire finding, technique, good precision. This, very important. Technique should have good power. That's important. So that's why when you do some breaking technique, you training with some seal, that, that's very important. <coughs> because you have to understand, the opponent, when he very angry, he has some surplus energy. He has the capacity. Probably he fall down maybe later. But that's how you need to be. So for example, you attack here with very good turning kick. Nobody can raise it. Fall down right away. Lie the lie the lead. Poof, like that. Okay. So some places here. That's why vital sport is no protection possible. No muscle there. Every people had the same uh, vulnerable place. And uh, for example, we talk about women's self-defense. The, the really, I believe, sincerely, every woman can defend with no problem. Only is, please be careful. Don't panic. Why? Because the time the guy wants to rape you, he very vulnerable. You hit directly in the right spot, he finished. <laughs> There's no protection there. That's the point. But how you can be can to control, that's a, the key of success. So practice, technique, but you need also mental training. Later on, I will explain to you about some meditation, some visualization, that's important. Okay, now, how, the last point now, you know this is the principle. Okay, then we go there. Okay, I divide three groups. The first, we call that convention. The second is improvisation. And the third is cycles. Okay. First is this one plus the pattern of the Daikin technique plus all your Taekwondo expertise. Okay. That all of that is your lucky. Okay. You know this, you know this. Now, we will show you that. What does it mean? It means either series of techniques, we will show you dividing by the origin of the attack. For example, I will show you all the technique where the opponent comes from facing. 
grabbing, dancing. Oh, I will, we will show you probably six techniques, but they plenty. But this is example, just give you idea. And you can do all of that to defend with any. Grandmaster Ben will show you some shop, I show you some hard technique. Yes. After that, we show you the opening come from the back. The come, opening come from the side. The one who come when you sit down, when you lie down. So this is important. So that means, and after that you can imagine what you want. Uh, you understand? So that just set your technique is this for me is example. Is there only the example? Okay, give you some ideas so after that you can do by yourself. The second one is interesting now. Is application. So second part, you stand up and I will tell the people surround you and attack you. They may attack you something here and may attack anything. The way it is like that, they attack, probably you defend very well, number one. Sometimes probably you stop, you didn't know. So I ask the partner, repeat but slow motion. Give your time to do it. And we end up, instructor can come and give you some advice. So we want to help you to become autonomous. Why? Because the time you have, you are facing aggressors, you are alone. I am not there, your instructor is not there. So that's why the improvisation allows you to develop your own reaction. And the last part is psychologist technique. There are some situations where the, the aggressor, they are professional. Or some situation, they are two, three, a group attack you. So, if right away you defend physically, no chance. Psychological approach means more strategy. How I apply psychologist technique? I will ask you to imagine in different movies you see, right? The top movie which and this stuck here. So believe, try to think you are the victim. And now how you how is, is your solution? So I want you like the scenarios in the movie, you write. The scenario, how you will. So that's not only technique. You need to have a lot of things to convey to diversion the opponent. So turn the situation advantage to you. You understand? So now we will start. We start with conventional. We do some application. This we don't have time, but this keep in mind. It's very good. Sometimes. I, I make some application for self-defense clinic, and I have some feedback from women. They say, well, some of them do it, and that's work. Psychologist technique only tell you is, sometimes the aggressors, the aggression, they are professional, and the aggression is very serious. Don't defend right away. You need to think. So you need to prepare, like the actor. Not you play the movie. How you can get some help, how to get some I think that turn the case to you. Your advantage. Correct?